first of the two bridges that we face crosses a major river gorge called the Mtentu River Bridge. This bridge is about 1.1 kilometers long and uh, it's built by the balanced cantilever method and if you look at this center span here, it means that you, you start at these high piers, which happen to be 140 meters high. In other words, 140 is one and a half rugby fields long, vertically. You do what is called incremental launch construction of the approach spans. In other words, if you start here, we launch, we, we build here, and we push the bridge out from here till it meets uh, this balanced cantilever span and likewise from the other end, we do the same thing. This bridge, as you can see in the model, looks absolutely different to the other one. It's a very spectacular, pristine gorge. It's a single span bridge and it's anchored back into rock on either end. These towers are about 125 meters high the method of construction is that you actually start at the near the, the pillars or the pylons and you start building the bridges out in sections between the cables. You, in other words, you, you build one section, then you hang it. Then you build the next section, you hang it. Likewise, you cut, do the, exactly the same from this side and eventually they join up in the center over there. And uh, it's a, certainly a first and it's the biggest cable stay bridge that would have been ever constructed in South Africa. We envisage awarding these bridges together. In other words, the construction will virtually start simultaneously on both bridges. The unskilled labor we'll be sourcing locally, but there's a lot of skilled labor here as well, which we've involved uh, international firms. Uh, no South African firm has ever done this balanced cantilever construction of this magnitude. Working at these heights with the associated wind problems. These bridges were tested in wind tunnel tests in uh, London, Ontario and Canada. We have safety barriers because one mustn't forget you are 200, 230 meters above the valley floor and so you don't want people just kind of leaning over the edge etc. Without the bridges uh, we cannot uh, complete this highway. And uh, specifically, we got to go across these gorges at a high level, as you can see. Because to try and get uh, roads down to the lower levels is just impossible. <laughs>